Don't write God G O D with a capital G, capital O, capital D. Please always write Allah L L H because there is no description of God in the Holy Quran. This first message is correct, and I said that in my talks on concept of God in major world religion and other talks of mine that God is not the appropriate translation of the English word Allah. And why do we Muslims prefer calling Allah A L L A H or A L L A A H with the Arabic word Allah instead of the English word God? Because the Arabic word Allah it cannot be played around with. It's a unique word. Whereas the English word God, G O D, if you add S to it, it becomes God's, meaning plural of God. There is no plural of Allah. Qul huwa Allah ad. Says Allah one and only. If you add D E S S to God, it becomes Goddess, meaning a female God. There is no male Allah or female Allah in Islam. Allah Subhanahu wa Taala has got no gender. If you add a father to God, it becomes Godfather. There is no Allah Abba or Allah Father in Islam. If you add a mother to God, it becomes Godmother. There is no Allah Mother or Allah Ami in Islam. If you prefix a tin before God, it becomes tin God, meaning a fake God. There is no tin Allah in Islam. That is the reason I say in my talks that God is not the appropriate translation of the Arabic word Allah. So the right word that Muslims should always use is Allah. But when you use this word God, when you are speaking to non-Muslim, they have got no objection because the non-Muslim may not be aware what is the meaning of the Arabic word Allah. Because English language cannot comprehend the Arabic word Allah. When you are speaking to non-Muslims, so they understand. For example, when we say La ilaha illallah, there is no god but Allah. So when you use the word God to translate Allah, because the non-Muslim doesn't know what Allah is, I think there is no problem. But when Muslims speak among themselves, they should. Use the Arabic word Allah for Allah and not the English word God or the Urdu word Khuda etc.